So you're never gonna guess where we are. <laughs> Just so happened we were here on a Friday and their Friday morning meeting is unreal. You need to implement this now. Hi, uh, we're doing our, our uh, Friday uh, office uh, sort of a, uh, never mind. Cut. <laughs> Ready? How do you do that? Like take two, take, take two. two. All right. Yeah, we're doing the, uh, the Friday meeting, which is uh, our company wide improvement meeting. Everyone gets together as a group and discusses what uh, the week's problems were and what the solutions for the previous week, uh, the problems were for that are. And that's just every Friday. That's every Friday, Friday's just meeting. to keep everyone up to speed as to what is happening in the company in case you're too focused on your own department. For incoming sheet goods in that area. So still waiting for the final approval. So Jason to customer. <laughs> <laughs> Not the picture. Okay. Yeah, for everybody to, um, to find exactly what they were looking for because we were noticing people were searching. Uh, so we've developed a kind of a somewhat of a placard slash label that we're going to be showing us how much more we can grow and improve as time goes on. So we're just going to keep at that today and uh, see where it takes us. And then customer stain samples need standards. Talk about the coolest meeting ever. Man, this is a mastermind right there. Um, wow, if everybody who sees this video doesn't implement this every Friday, oh my God, I've already texted my whole team, said we're implementing it, get it done. I sent them pictures of your slides and said implement immediately. So that was awesome. Every Friday, what are your big problems? What are you doing to solve them? And you present the following week. Wow, cool. Also super cool. Check this out. Yeah, okay, hang on. Jay, I'll show us how it works. What is it? So uh, this is a real fortune game. Every time you present, you gotta you gotta spin this board. Uh, on the board are some of our values and principles. One that we have here is sharpen the saw. So sharpen. If it was today was my meeting, I'd have to tell everybody why we have that principle, why it's important to us. And if I can't if I can't define what it is, then the group comes in and helps. Me. So for us, sharpening the saw is it's all about. Um, both personally and in your workspace, constantly continuing your own personal improvement. So, how are you growing as a person? You know, are you are you trying to get in shape? Um, how's your home life going? When you're at work, how are your skills increasing? Are you getting up and up and up um, on that that board? Whether it's the the matrix or whatever it is, how are you pushing yourself forward? It's good for your own uh, mental well-being, and it makes uh, work and home fun. So what I love about this is you don't know which one you're gonna have to present, you know? You could be presenting on any one, so it kind of gives, gives people a little bit of pressure to understand them all and know them all. Am I turning it the wrong way or does it matter? You gotta spin it, you gotta get ready to spin. I'm just trying to get them all in there. Cause these are such good principles. Love this thing. Love it, love it, love it. Which one am I talking about today? Synergize. So at the beginning of, of the year, um, we were having a lot of redundancy with different people at different times uh, when they were presenting their improvement time at the morning meeting. Um, it's important to keep a clean workspace and to 5S, but if that's all you're ever doing, for your improvements, then you're not growing as a lean thinker. And you're not contributing to the group. So you can't just every day say, oh, I swept up the floor, I emptied out the trash. You need to have a process improvement and that process improvement needs to be one of the five biggest problems that your department is facing if you guys are gonna move forward as a group. And so I got really frustrated with seeing the same thing over and over again. And so we changed our, our Friday meetings so that each Friday, you have to get up there and you have to, as a group, say, these are the five biggest problems that we're facing as a department. And then next Friday, when you come to get up in front of that same group, as a group, you better have moved, solved those problems or made a step towards solving them. And you never escape it. Every single Friday, we, we identify what our five biggest problems are for next week, but we also have to present on what we did to solve the problems last week. And if you didn't solve them, they're gonna stay on there. And I, I don't know if you guys saw in the, the meeting this morning, but I've had the CBOR on there for like four weeks and I just didn't want to come to the, today's meeting because 
I just like, it's like shame. I just, I haven't done it. I've been all over the country. It's nothing but an excuse. It needs to be done. Next Friday, I'm gonna have it done because I can't get up there again and say I didn't do it. They've only had their new sanding robot for two days and they've already got standards. The people that are working in the department have the option to hang up a flag from their country. So we have the Indian flag here and we have a Korean flag for the CNC operator. And way in the distance, got a, even a Chinese flag in the background. I'm not sure what one that is, but isn't that cool?